because I was told it was a very good opportunity to network with the right sort of designers, photographers, um, modelling scouts yeah. and magazine representatives and for a person like me it's very hard to break, you know, to get your foot in the door, make the initial step into the mainstream modelling industry. Mm -hmm. I do a lot of beauty modelling but I'm trying to get into fashion which is where the money is. Yeah. And today I'm here dressed by Sun Yu Lee, an award winning fashion designer and I'm wearing a uh, a rabbit hair jacket, a heavily embroidered silk shirt and white leather trousers. Well, you know, I think the first time I came in and the first thing I saw with that jacket, I was like, I'm not leaving without this jacket or once or once, it's very, very similar to this. <laughs> so, I mean, you know, you do, you do look like that, you know, you do, you do have like the model feature. How long have you been doing modelling for? I've been doing modelling for five years, but okay. I, was, I was restricted because I lived in a very small town in, okay. in Ply Plymouth, the city, but I was Plymouth's modelling agency's top earner. Um, earning the most that agency could offer in the southwest, and now I'm living um, more central to the city, so I'm looking to get signed by a bigger agency. Okay, excellent. Well, so have you been signed by agencies back in the past? Have you had like any catwalks, or this is like your first show that you've done personally? No, yeah, I mean, I've been signed at, at, at Glenby Modeling Agency since I was 15 years old, and I've been okay. doing very well there. I've done a number of fashion shows, including the Burton Suits and Next Spring and Summer, but I've never been signed by a mainstream fashion. fashion a model house like Select, Next or Storm, which are where I'm aiming as my next goal. Okay, so that's the next goal. That's uh, the next so goal. from Burton right to Clark to Marks and Spencer and so on. Yes. <laughs> Yeah, I've only just started, so it's one of my first. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
Yeah. It really looks like that you just wait to just get that glue on the face. Right? I know, it's like, because oh, like, when you eat a donut, you get sugar all around your lips. Getting into it, uh, I, lo I did a lot of it myself. Okay. So it was, rather than getting an agency or sign, I just looked for casting and all that sort of stuff, for my stuff. So yeah, just myself, hard work and determination really. Just that dedication and yeah, process thinking. Really. I like that. Okay, okay so are you actually signed right now? Right really? now I'm not signed now because I actually do acting mainly, but I do some work on the side, obviously that's what's in the show. Okay, so can, so can we see you on, on that big screen? You know, that um, I hope so soon, but obviously right now I've just done a few short films, that sort of stuff. Yeah, I mean, I've just been signed up by an agency, Sharon Harris, she's really good with me. Um, and I'm just getting a few short films, feature films at the moment, building together a showreel and just going to different premieres and just hoping for the best, really, hoping to get in a film. Wow, so, <laughs> so basically, so what brings you here to Winter Wonderland, you know, you know live on Friday nights? Yeah. Um, well, basically, I met Jemima, who's the, um, I, I can't remember what she does at Fashion Capital, she's, she's a she, she's, she's the boss of Fashion yeah. Capital and she's run this whole thing, she's organised this catwalk. Um, and I actually did some presenting before for Kiss 100 and I interviewed her before. Right. Um, so uh, yeah, she said to me, oh, would you like to model tonight? I was like, yeah, definitely, because she knows I've recently got some model experience. So yeah, and that's how that's why I'm here today. Wow. <laughs> so ever since last year, you've just been quick, 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 quick. Oh, uh, it's been every literally week. bang, 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 bang. Like so much is going on, it's crazy. But I'm really, really focusing just on my modelling and acting now. So yeah. So how long have you been for? Um, I started off late last year, 2011, um, so around November time, so I got into it. Um, and really, I'm just trying to uh, you know, just put my foot in there. Um, I came down to this event today mainly for networking purposes. Okay. Uh, I was invited by um, Kayla, she's one of the um, leading like, model yeah. fashion leaders out there. So yeah, she just um, emailed me and told me to come down and network. And, been going the so far. Yeah, so I've been having like, you know, like cards everywhere. Like, all yeah, I've actually spoken to quite a number of people. Um, they've got a few fashion majors coming out in the spring. So they were interested in getting some new models. So um, that's been interesting. Yeah, I mean, personally, there, there seems to be like a big lack of, 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 um, of male black models nowadays. So yeah. it would be very refreshing to see that more black models coming out of the market right now. So yeah. are you looking forward to the show? Are you trying to get signed? I've got a portfolio ready to, to I've got, 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 i no. Right, because personally, that, that was put more or less like perfection. You're happy with it. That was really good. I, I, I was in the background just drinking about it. I think I was all doing like that. But it was a good show. I enjoyed it. All the clothes, the designers, even the music just actually complimented it. All yeah, the models. Yeah. Do you like the music? Yeah, I like the music. I mean, personally, you know, personally, I'm a DJ, so you know, my, my selection is more about R&B. But that selection for for that kind of show. It has to fit the mood. 
it has to when you choose the music mm. it has to fit the mood for the clothes yeah. the walk the yeah. atmosphere everything so everything. when you choose the music yeah, yeah. But it's nice to have a little bit of, kind of difference between each track as well mm. have a little bit upbeat downbeat upbeat downbeat a little bit of a mix up it's yeah. great it's great so that music and fashion they go hand in hand they have to complement each other but well done for putting everything together Thank you. my name is Cole J this is Black Visions TV we're backstage at Club Aura for Winter Wonderland Catwalk Fashion Show like I said upstairs is completely crazy I've interviewed so many people people running here running there but you know something the catwalk was it was, it was, it was elegant but positive and also very, very structured, very, very well. Music and the clothes and the models, they, they complement each other very, very, very well. I mean, there were so many people, I had to go and feel my tiptoes to try and find somebody. But it was absolutely really, really good show. Uh, loads of custom designers. We had a um, lady from Big Brother as well, who was down there. The only way is Essex also in the house. Loads of people upstairs networking, um, drinks, people. Nuts, absolutely nuts. So you need to get yourself down here next time and have one. Obviously next month we've got London Fashion Week, so it's gonna be even more intense. So a lot more coming for Black Visions TV. My name is Cole J. Hope you enjoyed the show, hope you enjoyed the readback and all the other photos and all the interviews that are coming.